friends the united nations data has shown that almost 40% of the world's land is now degraded and half of the global population is at risk this situation is even more critical because the global population is ever increasing degraded land which has been de depleted of natural resources soil fertility water biodiversity trees or native vegetation is found all over the planet degraded land is often seen as arid desert rainforests defore deforested by loggers or areas covered in urban sprawl but it also includes apparently green areas that are intensely cultivated or stripped of natural vegetation intensive agriculture depletes the natural nutrition of the soil and exhausts the water resources overpopulation is a cause of it but intensified industrialization and the overconsumption of consumable goods in the highly industrialized countries are the major causes of degradation and pollution of land if our global habitat has to survive then we need to seriously rethink our agricultural methods which are responsible for 80% of deforestation 70% of fresh water use and the single greatest cause of terrestrial biodiversity loss according to a study it is time we abandon intensive agriculture control population on a global scale and leave the current industrial economic model of exponential rate of profit growth this requires that the industrialists should intensify their production exponential exponentially every year which leads to the exponential exploitation of natural resources the population has to be controlled across the global scale and not by each country's demographic profile further the excessive use of consumable goods as characterized by the highly industrialized countries has to stop these are not options but they are absolute necessities the un can play a role in getting the members to adopt measures which can seriously alter the lifestyles and evolve more eco-friendly lifestyles